Hey, Slippyhead here guys, back on NBA 2K17, taking a break from my park. If you check out my last video, you'll know why. So I'm back on my team. This is just a quick video on how to make MT. A couple of little ways that it'll build it up. I know at the moment I don't have much, I've got 4,480, which isn't a lot, just splurged on some packs. But there's a few methods here that'll help you build it. Some of you may be new to the game and you may not know a lot about it. Some of you may know some of these ways, but you know, they work. The first way is badges. Here's a list of all the badges that are worth selling. You, pro you may have a lot of them just sitting there. You may not know about them. They're just probably sitting in your collection. Some of them go for a lot, man. Here's a list of all the ones that are worth selling and how much they're actually going for at the moment on average. Another cool way is to sell duplicate shoes. You look in the, if you look in the bottom right corner of the card, you may see a little red number. Shoe cards actually count towards your actual collection this year, which is, which is pretty cool. So if you've got, you know, if you've got more than one of that card, put it on the auction block for, you know, if it's a, if it's a bronze shoe, just put it up for 250 and someone will buy it. Silver, probably a little bit more, but the gold ones go for a lot. I've got a Steph Curry one here going for 900, that'll sell. So yeah, if it's got a red number in the bottom right, like say if it's got like four, like a red four, you've got three you can put on the auction block, do it. Another cool way, when you're opening packs, if you're opening a lot of packs, you get a lot of contracts. I usually do golds for 350, silvers for 300, and bronzes for 250, and they always sell. I know they're little amounts of MT, but it all counts when you sell all of them. I mean, that's 2,000 MT probably sitting there on the screen. The collector levels are unreal. I've just got, I just unlocked 40,000 MT just by sniping shoes and sniping jerseys. So just look up what jerseys you don't have. Go to the auction house. Chuck in these, I usually, you can change the actual maximum buyout to about 400 or 350. And it pretty much, you can just buy all the jerseys. Just go through your collection, see the ones you don't have. I sometimes take a picture on my phone to see which teams I don't have. And then I just go in here and find the ones. And every card counts towards your collection. And therefore you can, you can basically unlock those big amounts of MT by, yeah, just buying jerseys. And, and also, it also works really well for shoes. Just go through and see what shoes you don't have. Um, you know, there's different colorways of shoes. There's heaps of them. So just see what shoes you don't have. You can pick them up for fuck all, like 250, 300 MT, and you just build that collection up until you get the 40,000, and then you're laughing. So that's just a few ways I make my MT. I know I don't have much at the moment, but you know, it really does. It really does work, and it really does build and, and add up, and you end up with a lot. So yeah, I hope this helped someone. Chuck us a like if it did help you at all. And if you want to subscribe, that'd be epic. Cheers, legends. Take it easy.